After watching the great hack from Netflix, data privacy has become a huge concern for me and my family. Apps, software, phones, computers, and other smart devices constantly have access to your private information that can be used by companies or even third parties for their benefit. If you have a Windows PC, then you should know that even Microsoft collects your data through a telemetry system. If you are not comfortable with this, as I am, you can disable the telemetry on Windows 11 and prevent Microsoft from snooping at your data. Alright. We will be doing settings updates in four different areas here. For the first one we will need to go to the settings. I will pop up a link above which you can also find in the video description below for my Windows 11 tips and tricks if you want to know how I have set up this cute little icons in my start menu. Another way to open the settings is by pressing the Win and I keys from your keyboard. You can learn more about Windows 11 useful keyboard hotkeys by watching another video of mine, with links also in the video description below, and I will pop up at the right top corner of the screen right about now. Let's open the settings by using this icon from the start menu here, so we can limit the data being gathered by the Microsoft log. From the settings, click the privacy and security from the left side menu. From the center, find and click on the diagnostics and feedback. From here you will see the send optional diagnostic data which is turned on by default. When on, the company will be able to get further data about the apps you use, the websites you visit, and many other things. But when it is disabled, Microsoft can only collect data about hardware, system settings, and processes. So, let's just switch that off. And we're done with the first part. Next we'll need to disable some Windows services. Click the Start button and search for Services. Right-click on it, and run it as Administrator. This will open the list of Windows services. From the list, find Connected User Experiences and Telemetry. Double-click on it to open the service. Then on the General tab, under the Service Status, if the service is running, click the Stop button. There we go. To make the service stop permanently, in the Startup type, select Disabled. Then click the Apply or OK button to save the changes. We got one more item to stop and disable. Look for Device Management Wireless Application Protocol WAP Push Message. Open the service. This one is not running, so we don't need to stop it anymore. But we still do need it to disable it. Then click the Apply or OK button to save. And we're done with the second part. Now let's do the Command Prompt part. Click the Start, then search for CMD, then right-click on Command Prompt and open it as Admin. We will need to enter the command SC, space config, space diag track, space start equal disabled, which will disable the diagnosis tracking on Windows. Then press Enter, and you will receive a success notification for the command. We will need to execute another command to disable the push service. Type in again SC config. Then DMWAP push service start equal disabled. Then press Enter again. A success notification should appear as well. The two commands are a bit long, so I have added them in the video description, so you can easily copy them and paste to command prompt. On to the fourth and last part. The task scheduler. Click Start and search for Task Scheduler. As usual, run it as admin. From the Task Scheduler screen, on the left side part, expand the Task Scheduler library item. Then click the arrow beside Microsoft to expand it as well. Then expand Windows. Then from the sub-items, look for Customer Experience Improvement Program and click on it. This will show two items in the center part of the screen. The Consolidator and USB CEIP. Right-click on the consolidator then click on Disable, to disable the item. Now click on the USB CEIP, right-click, Disable. And we're done. All you need to do now is restart your machine. You are now safe from any snooping from Microsoft. You now have one less device to worry about using your personal data for someone else's gain. Alright. That will be it for this one. I hope this helps. If you enjoy this video, give me a thumbs up. If it has helped you in any way, please do consider subscribing to the channel. Nilasuj for watching. Noba Air.